comes from the United States in a historic moment in U.S. political history. Democratic presidential nominee Joe Biden has named Kamala Devi Harris as his vice presidential running mate. Kamala Harris as the vice presidential pick now shatters many glass ceilings across the United States presidential history. Harris is now the first black woman as well as the first Indian American woman to be chosen for the national office. Her parents were immigrants to the United States. Her father from Jamaica and her mother from India. Born to a biracial family, Harris has been a barrier breaker for much of her political career. In a tweet, the presumptive Democratic nominee said that it was a great honor to choose Harris. Biden also called her one of the country's finest public servants, thus an obvious choice for his running mate. Biden's announcement came amid weeks of buzz about who he would choose as his running mate. According to sources, Biden's search committee poured more than thousands of records and conducted several interviews for months. Once a top challenger of Biden's during the 2020 Democratic primaries, Kamala Harris seems to be the one who ticked all the boxes for Joe Biden. Taking to Twitter shortly after the announcement, Harris said that she was honored to join Biden as the vice president pick and would do what it takes to make him our commander in chief. That's what she said in a tweet. Since Biden's vice presidential nominee choice was released, reactions have been pouring in from across the United States. The most prominent one is, however, from America's first black president. That is former President Barack Obama, who in a tweet said that Joe Biden nailed this decision in picking Harris as his running mate. Kamala Harris's challengers in the Democratic primaries have also lauded this decision, calling it a historic one. Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders even went ahead to say that Harris will make history as an ex-vice president. Meanwhile, Biden's choice does not seem to have gone down too well with the current U.S. president. Trump hit back at Biden's vice presidential choice, even saying that he was a little surprised by it. Listen in. Uh, I can't tell you what she's voting for. I don't think she knows what. I think Joe knows even less than she does. But I was a little surprised at the pick. A lot of people were saying that might be the pick. I was more surprised than anything else because... She did so poorly. Many people did much better than her in the primaries. She did very poorly in the primaries. And that's like a poll. Harris is only the third woman to be chosen as a running mate on a presidential ticket. Her pick follows that of a de Democrat, Geraldine Ferraro, in 1984, and a Republican, that is Sarah Palin, in 2008. Biden and Harris will formally accept the Democratic nominations during the party's convention to be held virtually next week. If Biden does defeat Trump in the November presidential elections, Harris will become the first woman in U.S. history to serve as vice president.